What is going on, gentlemen? Welcome to week number five already of our Shut Up and Set program. My name is Mike Massey, also known as Mindful Mike. This week, we are looking at the crazy world of noting and observing our emotions. Now, I know for most men, we have a natural resistance into exploring our emotions. You know, recently, I was working with the military, I was working with this one individual, and I was talking to him. I said, when's the last time you were angry? And he had to sit and think about it, and then I asked him, okay, where do you experience that emotion? And he said, what do you mean where? And I said, well, think about it. In your body, think about the last time that you're mad or frustrated or angry or upset, and just take note of where that emotion was the strongest. And he said, I don't really know. So I had him go back and think about that time. And he said, and he said I think my chest and maybe my fists. For most of us, we are unaware of where we experience our emotion. Where in our body? Remember that before we ask, ask what, ask where, ask the purpose, right? What is present? Do the exact same here with these emotions. So think of the last time that you were mad, angry, frustrated, or upset. You can close your eyes, you can just bring it forward and think about it. Last time, for, me, for sure with me, I felt it in my chest. Now the problem with most of this is that we bury it down, and again, over time, we keep burying things down, and eventually they add up and then have that explode. Now what we want to do is we're not using our practice of mindfulness to go, well, right now I'm really angry, breathing in, breathing out, oh, I'm no longer angry, that's impossible. What we're doing is we're looking at whatever is there, so whatever emotion is there, and letting it be there. Last week we looked at letting it be there for just this moment. This week we're look, looking at letting it be there and not trying to manipulate it. So we're gonna go way back to week one. We did that four in breathing. One, two, three, four, out, two, three, four. Exact same protocol, but we're gonna bring a difficult emotion forward and we're gonna say on the breathing in, we're gonna say to ourselves, noticing this emotion, breathing out, acknowledging this emotion. We're gonna breathe in, we're gonna to say to ourselves, I'm noticing this emotion, breathing out, acknowledging this emotion. This is the key. What we are doing is we're labeling what is actually present instead of getting in their hamster wheel and adding to what you could have done or diff should have done differently. Or what might happen when you go into work for that two o'clock meeting. We're looking and dealing with what is actually happening in this present moment. You know, one of my best buddies works in the prison systems and he said to me, Mike, if I can use this, in my line of work, in the middle of chaos, anyone can use it. And he said to me what he was doing one day is he was you know, experiencing anger and frustration. In real time, he breathed in and said to himself, noticing this frustration, and he breathed out and acknowledged it. Now that does not get rid of the situation that's happening in front of him, but what allows him to do is respond in a healthier way, to label what he's actually experiencing and then choose what to do and not react. So for you, this week, all we're doing is we're planting the seed of you being able to note your emotions. The exact same baseline as a four in, four out, we're gonna breathe in and say to ourselves, noticing this emotion. Breathe out, we're gonna say acknowledging it. All you have to do is go to mindfulmike.ca, go on over to program, shut up and sit, hit your password in, and then go down to week number five. After this video, you're gonna see there's a short practice on noting emotions. I want you to do it this week. Of course, if any questions, comments, or concerns, hit me up at mindfulmike.ca, hit contact Mike, or DM me like most of you are doing via Mindful Massey, M-A-S-S-E. Try it out this week, hope you like it. If any questions, let me know. Talk to you soon, bye for now.